ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿಂದ ಸಹೋದಿ ಶ್ರೀನಂದನಂದನ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಮಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತುರ್ವಶ್ಯ ಪಾಸಿಂದುಭ್ಯವಶ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೇಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಗ ಪಂಗುಂಗಲಂಘಿರಿ ಯತ್ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದೆ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈತುಸಿದೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶ್ವಶ ಕೃಷ್ಣಭಕ್ತಿ ಪದೇ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನರಂಚೈವ ನರೋತ್ತಮ ದೇವಿಂಗ್ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶ ನೀಚ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿ ಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋಧ್ವರುಣ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಿರಂಚನುತ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಭೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪನುತಪಾಲ್ಲಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರುಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ಪಾದಲ್ಲವನಖಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಿಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಪವಧೂಷು ಅದರ್ಶಿ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರಸಾಗರಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮಯಿ ಕದಾಂಕರೋಸಿ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನೇತ್ರಾನಂದ ಶಿವಾದೈತಕದಾಧರ ಶಿವಸಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನೇತ್ರಾನಂದ ಶ್ರೀಯಾದೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದಿ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಅಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತಭುಜೌ ಕನುಕಾಬುಧಾತು ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೈಕಪಿತರು ಕಮಲಾಯಕ್ಷು ಭೀಷಾಂಬರೌ ದ್ವಿಜವರೌ ಜುಗಧರ್ಮಪಾಲೌ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾಭತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿಬ್ಬರೂಪ ಭುಕ್ತಿ ಚ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ಚದಿ ನಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇನ್ನ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತುರ್ವಶ್ಚ ಕಿಪಾ ಸಿಂಧು ಬಿವಚ ಪತಿ ಪಾವನೆ ಭವಿಷ್ಣೋಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭುಷೀತ ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣೋ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗ ಮದಾಪಹಾರಂ ವರಾನಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ವ ಚ ಭಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ಯಾಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬಿಹಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜೆ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ಭಜೇ 
ಸಮಸ್ತಪಾಪಖಂಡನಂ ಭಜೆ ಭಜೈ ಕಮಂಡನ ಸಮಸ್ತಪಾಪಖಂಡನ ಸದೈವನಂದನಂದನ ಸಭಾಕ್ತಪಾಪರಂಜನ ಸದೈವನಂದನಂದನ ಭಜೆ ಭಜೈ ಕಮಂಡನ ಸಮಸ್ತಪಾಪಖಂಡನ ಸಭಾಕ್ತಚಿತ್ತರಂಜನ ಸದೈವನಂದನಂದನ ಸದೈವನಂದನಂದನ ಗೌರಿಯ ಗೋಷ್ಠಿಪತಿ ಶ್ರೀಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಜಗ ಬಹುಭಾ ಪರಮಂಶ ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಟೋಲ್ಡ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಾಂಡ ಭ್ರಮಿತ ಕೋನೋ ಭಾಗ್ಯವಾನ್ ಜೀವ ಗುರು ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪ್ರಸಾದ ಪಾಯ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಲತಾ ಬೀಜ ಗೌರಿಯ ಗೋಷ್ಠಿಪತಿ ಶ್ರೀಶಿಲ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಸಿದ್ಧಾಂತ ಸರಸ್ವತಿ ಗೋಸ್ವಾಮಿ ಜಗ ಬಹುಪಾ ಪರಮಂಶ ಜಗದ್ಗುರು ಟೋಲ್ ದ್ಯಾಟ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮಾಂಡ ಭ್ರಮಿತ ಕೋನು ಭಾಗ್ಯವಾನ್ ಜೀವ ಗುರು ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಪ್ರಸಾದ ಪಾಯ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಲತಾ ಬೀಜ directly or indirectly everything done by bhagwan <coughs> directly or indirectly everything done by bhagwan we are only going to claim that i am the owner i am the doer this kind of thing bhagwan going to arrange this kind of whole this all around our there is countless problem in our life countless problem coming to destroy our life all the time different kind of problems coming popa speaking all those problems are there to make you understand the problem at all why you are going to face problem those problems are the, there all around to put you in trouble to destroy your life but popa speaking problems are there it is very good countless problems are there very good those problems are there to make us understand that not necessary why you are going to face problem i wanted to call you come to me but you are going that way i wanted to call you you come to me but you are not you are going that way so i am missing making you are going to face problem problems are not at all necessary problems are all useless in your life to make you understand this point bhagwan repeatedly indirectly i mean maya going to face send us problem countless problem in our life in upanishad in upanishad we find one shloka there upanishad speaking uttishtata jagrata prapta varana nibodhato khurasya dhara nishithaya durgam patastat kavayo vadanti upanishad speak upanishad speaking why you are sleeping why you are sleeping whole life after life you are sleeping we are not sleeping four hour or five hours the sadhus they are taking rest four hours mix, maximum and maybe you are taking seven six hours eight hours but whole life actually we are sleeping whole life after life we are sleeping actually sleeping mean our consciousness not growing we are sleeping that's why upanishad upanishad going to speak uttishtata prapta varana nibodhato all blessings are there waiting for you all blessings are there waiting for you why you are not taking prapta varana nibodhato try to grow your consciousness try to come forward but people not going to give any response very dear to grow consciousness is the most vital things any how five types of limbs of bhajan mahaprabhu speaking specially nine folds of bhakti already there but five specially mahaprabhu speaking sadhu sangha mathura vas simuti shraddhay sevan naam sankirtan bhagavat sevan you know this kind of five and this kind of five limbs my possibly 
if somebody is going to have slight link, slight link with this five, any of these five, slight links, he can grow bhakti if there is no aparag inside heart. But big problem. Different kind of ten types of aparad, nama aparad, you know, ten types of nama aparad. Someday I can discuss with you. Ten types of different aparad and other different kind of my anartha going to put me in trouble. I cannot make any progress in my bhajan. Big problem. One day I was going to Himalaya, Himalaya, I was going to Himalaya, maybe it was Kedarnath, I was going towards. I reached Rudra Kunda, I reached one place, hilly place, big. There I meet Rudra Kunda, special place. All three rivers coming from different sides collide with each other and big, you know, I took bath also, take it. Because there is heavy current. Current means if, if you are somehow disbalanced, you can go away. So somehow we take bath there. After that, there was one open place where sadhus, they can stay. For the night, I took decision to stay there. And somehow, some rice I could uh, bake from some place. And only one pot. Only nothing. Only one pot. In the air, some potato, everything I'm boiling, boiling, I'm going to offer and after that doing bhajan at the bank of this ashram. I was really indifferent, I was thinking. So deep feeling coming in that time. Suddenly one sadhu, I don't know, maybe he's from Nimbarka Sampadaya. He approached me, he is speaking to me, Baba, what you are thinking? He come in front of me, I never saw that sadhu. He is discussing with me, different tata I was discussing. Night time we stayed together. Morning time that sadhu gone down, I gone off. He was speaking all about his different experience of life, uh, bhajan experience. We exchange some views, friendly, we make some friend, you know, friendly relation. After that sadhu that gone down, I was going up. Still today I don't meet with that sadhu. Gone, gone forever. This way, all our, I am thinking, it is written in Bhagavatam. Our association, our friendship, our love, fear, whatever we are exchanging in material world, really so. It is just like an in, you know, in, you know, dharma sala. You understand dharma sala? That's you. Okay. I double an in. Yes. Dharma sala. Like dharma sala. You are coming from some place. I am coming from some place. She is coming from some place. We stay night time. Morning time you go there. I go there. This is our life. This is our friendship. This is our... You know, relationship, husband, wife, friend, brother, mother, all this, like one, unstable. Like Vasudevji Maharaj, in front of Vasudevji Maharaj, Naraji Maharaj speaking, it is just like a Dharma Sala, all coming and after that was scattered here, for never come back. You can see in sea beach, those sand are there, you know, with each other. One big storm, storm coming, and that sand embracing each other, gone, flying away. This is our life. Most unstable life. But we are going to put ourselves in bondage. Papa speaking. Bonded soul purposely going to put them up. There is no reason. There is no reason purposely bonded soul want to put him in Him in problem. Unnecessary. 
Krishna Leela, I mean, Krishna Leela, they are in Vrindavan, Krishna doing Leela. By the help of that Leela, we can understand how to lead our life. Krishna actually wanted to do different, different kind of Leela. In the cow, in the pasturing field here, there. Those Leela wanted to give us the inner meaning of life. Krishna wanted to give us the inner meaning of life. Why you are going to make so factory, this, that? Why you are going to, you know, marry? Why you are going to do so many things? Actually, this all, actually, unnecessary. All jivas, they should love Bhagavan. Marriage is okay, not that. With affinity, I am speaking about those who are having great affinity for sansar, for them. Sansar is good, otherwise where from we can come. Sansar is not bad. But affinity is very bad. Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to say, you can play with me. Like in the field, Bhagavan's playing with all his friends, everything. Hold. Every time Bhagavan playing, always and every time with sporting mood. Bhagavan wanted to make us understand, you play with me. I like to play with you all. Why you are going to make fact? You see, in the beginning of civilization, now question is there at all how this life, you know, life came in this earth. How this life came in this earth. This form, after the civilization, gradual promotion. Now you see so much busyness. Everybody you see so busy, they have no time to think about Bhagavan. But they, if they think with cold brain, they can understand this, this was actually not necessary. All this creation, you see, all busyness, all busyness, how to understand, all this busyness, all busy people, crazy people, they, all their busyness is due to calm. They have karma, desire. That's why there's so many busyness. You need something, somebody is going to supply that thing. He needs something, you are going to supply something. Exchange this whole world, full of karma. If there is no at all karma, then there is no question of fighting, nothing can happen. No question of fighting. No question of any demand except, except Krishna Seva. Due to this karma, wicked karma, all different kind of thing we need. I need this one, I need this one. Or like crow, you know, one crow going to collect some uh, piece of dirty thing. Coming. This is also necessary to lead sangsar. The crow speaking, I need this to lead my sangsar. The crow going to collect this, you know, this way. Everybody likes to collect all. They are going to collect garbage. Kishne Tarabastu. Prabhupada many times used to say to collect Kishne Tarabastu is a chronic disease of bonded soul. To collect Kishne Tarabastu, which, which has no link with Krishna Bhajan. To collect, to collect such things, to collect such things which has no link with Krishna Bhajan because you are not to engage in Krishna Bhajan. Na? To collect this kind of useless thing in your life is a chronic disease of bonded soul. Bonded soul cannot stop. You need this one, this one, this one. So big, I know, in the whole, throughout this world, there is one karma jagya. Karma jagya. Big. Going on. But ultimate point, everybody going to, for, everybody going to forget this ultimate point. What is the ultimate point? They forget. They are busy with so many things, but they forget the ultimate point. So, Upanishad speaking, Uttishyata Jagrata Prabhu. You get up, you are sleeping, like dead body. Sleeping mean, our sleeping mean, dead body. Those who are pure sadhu, they are sleeping. In, in sleeping, they are also watching Bhagavan, doing seva, so many things. For pure devotees. But for us, sleeping mean, we are dead. Dead body. So, Upanishad speaking, you get up, Uttishtata Prabhu, Uttishtata Jagrata Prabhu, Varano, all blessings are waiting for you. 
you are not taking, it is due with you. You should take it, you collect it, and try to grow your consciousness. Uttishtadaya Grupapu Varano Nibodhata Kurasadhara Kurasadhara Nishithaya Durgam Patastat Kavayo Vadanti Kavayo Those Rishi Munis, big, big realized soul, Sadhu Guru Vaishnav, they are going to give you alarm. Like alarm, na? At the time of World War, I know when I was married, China Indian fighting. China Indian, when I was a small boy, then government give instruction, all should be blackout. There should be no light. Because China want to destroy, you know, you know, in different important places. So all lock out. They, if they are at all doing something, light focus here only. Light if going outside, police can come, take you. Hello. Big fighting going on, unnecessarily. This country like to attack, this country like to attack. This way, unnecessarily fighting. It is the documents there, that in Mangal, Mars, there was big civilization. In Mars, there was big civilization, more than us. But this civilization already totally destroyed due to nuclear war. Already destroyed. Some small boy took birth in Russia. He can remember what was there in his speaking all about. I was there in Mars. My father, mother all died this way. I also die. I come here. He remember speaking this one. So it's very mysterious. At least if you look at the sky in the night time, if you, at least if you look at the sky in the night time, you can think, who am I? Where from I came? Where from I came? Where I will go after this life? Nobody is going to think. Prabhupada speaking repeatedly, we must think about it. But nobody, everybody busy with this enjoying of life. They are not. And life is like Life is like, Upanisha speaking, like you are going to take one sharp-edged, you know, sharp-edged knife. Knife, you know, knife? Very sharp cutter knife. Upanisha speaking, you are just taking trouble to eh, move over, run over a sharp-edged knife. Kuroshadhara Nishitaya. You are just running over one sharp knife. But it's natural. If you are going to put one hand, it can cut. Naturally, if you put one hand, the sharp edge, you can cut it. Whereas you are going to run over a sharp edged knife. This is your enjoyment, life. This is your, in every step and step you are going to cut your cut your leg, a blood coming, you are feeling pain, you are crying, father going on, husband going away from this material world, but still you are going to make some different kind of plan and program. A future I can do this, I can put some money in a bank, I can make some insurance, so that in old age who can say, who can know? Maybe I am not going to meet with old age, before that I can go away. Is there any guarantee? I can stay up to old age. How long I can? There is no guarantee. There is no guarantee when I can go away. Whereas Parikhit Maharaj, already he got the notice. Parikhit Sila, Parikhit Maharaj got the notice that at least seven days he is going to stay. Parikhit Maharaj getting certificate, notice, that at least seven days he is going to leave. Before seven days anyway he is not going to die. But there is no surety. So we are going to deposit some, uh, you know, security deposit, some insurance, some this, some... So we need to secure our life. But anyway, you can try your best to secure our life. Anyway, you can try. I am not speaking you don't do. You can try. Because if you are not trying, you cannot believe me. You will have to face with problem. You will have to face with problem. Uh, you will have to face your problem. You will have to meet with uh, this kind of problem. Then you can remember I told this kind of harikatha. Otherwise, my harikatha cannot enter. It's good. It's good. You face with different kind of problem and you 
become tired and sit just like the just like the sannyasi that tridandi sannyasi when all way block he is at bay when all way block up no where to go he is just feeling alone where to go how to go how i can maintain myself nothing there then he could realize that this is for my blessing नूनम में संतुष्ट भगवान हरि ही निश्चित आई एम डेफिनेट टूडे भगवान इज सेटिस्फाइड विथ मी बिक अदरवाइज हाउ टूडे आई एम ग्रोइंग दिस काइंड ऑफ यू नो कॉन्शियसनेस बट बिफोर दैट सिक्सटी आई एम जस्ट सिक्सटी ईयर्स ओवर सिक्सटी ईयर्स ओवर आई नेवर स्टॉप्ड आई नेवर स्टॉप थिंकिंग दिस पॉइंट बट नाउ दियर रियलेशन कमिंग दिस इज द इंटरप्रिटेशन ऑफ योर लाइफ that sanyasi now thinking i am at bay i have no no where to go i am helpless nobody going to help me in that case that sanyasi realizing well it is the blessings of bhagwan otherwise today i am growing my consciousness level high consciousness it is good it is one kind of blessing so that i am put so that i am put already in this in this dangerous situation and i develop detachment is blessing the day you can de develop detachment that is called blessing don't think you are getting money but you have it is blessing not blessing it is cars some somebody maybe some girl waiting for you you can marry her this kind of plan and program in your life always going going but if bhagwan not going to approve you cannot get man can plan man can take decision man can take decision man can plan but if bhagwan going to disprove it not going to approve then what you can do our life is just like a puppet on a chain you know our life is just puppet on a chain puppet you know puppet on a chain puppet on a chain like you know puppet you know on a chain playing dancing puppet on a chain if you at all can face somebody speaking in his like three four times he is begging blessing from me he is blessing three or four times first time i was in vrindavan long ago he is speaking i develop brain cancer maharaj i develop brain cancer i'm going to die if you if you save me i say i cannot save my guru maharaj can save i can try i cannot say i have no power so this way he was about to die he is crying all his father mother wife all crying mother is going to die brain cancer go doctor speak is not going to live ultimately he go to south india velor i at that time i was worshiping i was uh, no, doing seva of dauji maharaj simply i say dauji i am not i am not going to give you service this much i can say if you think it fit if you think it fit you can you can look the case i am not speaking dauji you will have to you know you have to say no i am not speaking because i have no right i have no right to give service to dauji maharaj i am servant of dauji maharaj i say this is the case that you know that that you know poor man crying if you think you if you think something you can do or if you don't think you don't really so he was about to die he come back but before going to hospital i mean to velor he promised me i tell you you can do hari bhajan if you come back i can do hari bhajan he promised me but when come back not doing hari bhajan he promised me i can do hari bhajan but not doing hari bhajan then again he meet with three or four times four three or four times he is going to die almost die no father can save every time send some information by somebody maharaj i am this condition one day he is crying and speaking maharaj actually last time when i was 
at bed in hospital. He is speaking his own realization. When I was in bed in hospital, I saw my next bed, next bed, the patient dying. That patient dying. They are crying night time. So I was also going to die, almost. As if the death is, death is standing near my door. He is speaking, I meet with the door, I meet with the death. He say, I meet with the death, but you, but he is speaking, you bring me back. I say, I didn't. Bhagavan, help you. But still, after coming back, still they, still today, they are not going to take decision to do bhajan. Many times he told, Maharaj, I, I already meet with death. But you meet with death, but still you are not thinking it necessary. I told him to hear Harikatha over internet. He is speaking, I am hearing. This is their hearing. If at all one Harikatha you are going to hearing from your heart, surely you can save yourself. But nobody hearing properly what to do. Everybody knows whom, everybody knows that we are going to die. Death is such a thing. Death is such a thing. The literal meaning we know. Death means to live body. Literal meaning. But where is direct feeling? If you have direct feeling, if you meet with the death, then how you are going to play again? How you are going to play again? Life is going, but we are playing. How? If you really understand what is death, nobody understands. I think nobody understands. I think nobody understands the meaning of death. That's why they are playing. If they understand the real meaning of death, the instant, like Parikhid Maharaj, he could realize what is death immediately. Immediately, Khattanga Maharaj, Khattanga Maharaj, he took decision within fraction of a second. Immediately, when here, you are going to die after 48 minutes. When Khattanga Raja was informed, after two muhurta, two muhurta mean 48 minutes. 24 minutes mean one muhurta. You are going to die. Huh? 48 minutes left? Yes. Okay. I don't need anything. I don't need it. But he concentrate. He becomes successful. 40 mi 48 minutes was more than sufficient for him. 48 minutes. Parikhid Mahasun, seven days is more than sufficient. Sadhu Sangha, Sadhu Sangha, Sarva Sasya Koi, Lava Matto Sadhu Sangha, Sarva Siddhi Hoi. If you are going to do Sadhu Sangha from heart, like you are going to get the association of your wife from heart, I know you are going to get the association of your wife and husband from heart, but you are not going to get association from, of Sadhu from heart. Ah, okay. This can be there also. This can be also. Okay. They like to make all proper adjustment. But all proper adjustment, this way you cannot meet. You are making some adjustment. Unstable adjustment. Everybody planning something. They are not going to realize. That's why in our life we cannot realize Tattva Vigyan. That's why in our life we cannot realize Guru Vaishnava, Bhagavan. One second, one, one second divided by eleven. One second divided by eleven. That much time is more than sufficient to help you to attain complete realization. I told you, you know, one day, one man due to big problem in the house, he come out of the house. He come out of it. He didn't take a decision to go away forever. He's going out. But when he meet one sadhu and hear, hear one, one line of Bhagavatam, Asar sansar khalu dukshrupi bimaka shutah kasya dhunam kasya snehovan jalate anisham. This. Asar sansar khalu dukshrupi bimaka 
श्रुत कश्य धन कश्य स्नेहवान्न जलते अनीशम न च इंद्र सुखम किंचिन्न सुखम चक्रवर्तिन सुखमस्ती विरक्त मुने रेकांत जीवन ओनली दो साधु दे आर हैप्पी ओनली दो साधु दे आर हैप्पी ऑल इज हैप्पी लाइक चाइल्ड वन स्मॉल बेबी फादर डाइंग इज प्लेइंग वन स्मॉल बेबी यू कैन सी वन स्मॉल बेबी इज नो आइडिया फादर गॉन फादर गॉन इज नो आइडिया नो इफ यू स्पीक यूर फादर गॉन यू कैन नॉट अंडरस्टैंड गॉन मीन इज प्लेइंग स्मॉल बॉय small boy i have no information i read when i was student uh, i was a 10th class student that time that i read one english poem home home they brought her warrior death home they home they brought her warrior death why me? meaning literal meaning you cannot there's a inner meaning one beautiful lady she is married just for 4 years maybe maximum one small baby there nothing else and husband working in military husband working military husband working military so one day in military you know you will have to go with gun and the husband the some opponent party fire so many fire is very hero very good person at but he dying it is a rules if the even military man going to die if the family members deserve they were to bring the bread body there with the military car then all military car military man going to take the dead body cover up with cover up with cloth and they are taking you know out of car military van caravan of van and the dead body is there only face you can see and the small boy playing all they are going to bring the dead body of husband and the mata ji i mean the wife just like statue mata ji cannot speak anything just like one stone he is looking no tears coming nothing and the boy is there playing and the dead body in the body dead body in the room dead body already brought in the room all around people they are crying all relatives everything but the wife cannot cry so much shock so much shock even the tears not rolling down even tears from he is like a stone cannot move stand still all eyes everything like going to die boy playing boy have no idea boy have no idea is playing a small boy playing father die father die who is father? no idea after that what happened one old lady one old lady of 80 years 80 85 years one old lady that old lady she has experience she is watching that we that husband already gone husband already gone in the fighting and wife of also can die and who can take care of this small baby because the condition of this womb i mean i'm this lady she is going to die she cannot uh, bear the shock immediately what happened that lady is so clever she is going to take this small boy small baby baby playing there going to take the baby and put in the lap of mother put in the lap so so intelligent immediately she going to put the baby in the lap of mother then mother started crying hello so clever because if baby is there when baby is there she can remember how i can take care of this baby i am alone then started crying if if tears not crying if tears not rolling down then you are going to meet with big disease maybe heart attack something tears coming out my is gone emotion gone if tears coming is good tears coming is good but this way so this is all life so people they are going to meet with countless problem but still they are not going to take decision we will have to do hari bhajan without hari i know different kind of 
religious, religious, you know, religion there. But ultimately, all religion, we want to respect. You are not going to speak anything rubbish. We respect. But Bhakti Vinod Thakur wanted to prove, not only Bhakti Vinod Thakur, also in Bhagavatam you can see, all religion, all religion ultimately coming and going to submerge with Bhagavad Dharma's lotus feet of Bhagavad Dharma. Like all rivers, like all rivers, <coughs> Like all rivers, ultimately coming, they are bound to meet with ocean. It's a must. All rivers, wherever, maybe Bolga River, maybe Mississippi, any river. But ultimately they are going to meet with ocean. <coughs> so all different kind of religion, maybe some religion is related with, too much related with body, some religion too much related with my mental thing. But ultimately, they are not going to deal with the absolute pure interest of Atma. Ultimately, they are not going to deal with the secret tattva of Atma tattva. That is only you can find in Bhagavatam. Only and only you can find in Bhagavatam. If you go through, even if you go through Upanishad, if you are not elevated soul, you cannot understand anything. You can go through Upanishad. I can give you all Upanishad, 108 Upanishad. You have information. Eh? You have any information. 108 Upanishad. 108 Upanishad. Maybe there are Sab Upanishad, Puran also, so many. After Sab Puran, Upa Puran, so many Puran. If I can give you all books, you can study and give me the gist. What relation you can get? Even Upanishad, you can go, you cannot understand. So high theme. If you go to Veda, you cannot understand. Veda, from Veda, the extract is Upanishad. And Vedanta is the most vital points. Vital points, not point. Ved our Vedanta is the most, some some vital points of Veda. Veda from, from Veda all extract that is in the form of Vedanta. All our, all our, all our country, whole country, because India is a land of spiritual cultivation, total India. Maybe Farsi, Turki, British, Muslim, they all attack India. Wanted to destroy India. Wanted to loot. They want to take away all property. India was the richest country in the world. India was the richest country in the world. India is the richest country in the world. Still today, nobody knows. So many property and everything taken away from India. Totally. So many property taken away from India mercilessly. Still today, India is the richest country in India. But you have no information. You don't know what all other resources, what all resources are there. In Himalaya, you have no information. What all resources are there in whole India, nobody knows. Everything de depends on resource mobilization. You know, in economics you can find one word. <coughs> developed country, they are developed because of their technique of mobilization of resources. If you are very expert to, to mobilize your resource, then you can become rich. But India less interested, not so much. They actually... So, India was the richest country in the world. India is the richest country. It is still today. But nobody knows. So much. Regarding spiritual property, regarding gold and ornament, everything, diamond, anything. So India is the topmost. But so many outsiders want to, wanted to invade. So many outsiders, they wanted to invade, attack India and take away everything. But still today, they could not change the realization of Indian people. They could not, they could not change their Baba because our Baba is based on our deep-rooted Vedanta. It is not created by any man. Not created by any man, so that you can do something. It is already there from infinity period. 
So nobody can change. So this is the condition of our country. This is our situation. But so many people wanted to invade India, but they couldn't do anything. No change. Still today, Sanatan Dharma is Sanatan Dharma. Sanatan Dharma is Sanatan Dharma. You can try your best to destroy Bhagavad Dharma, but cannot. So I was discussing so many secret tattva regarding this, you know, 24 different gurus, and finally I was uh, discussing about. Anyway, nobody can avoid. Five different kind of enjoyment is a basic thing. Sabda, sparso, rup, rasgan. Any enjoyment, any enjoyment, you you try to think, you try to sit and calculate. Any kind of enjoyment can come, and basically you can find have a link with sabda, sparso, rup, rasgan. Basically, maybe you are going to enjoy a diversified enjoyment. Maybe. But basically, if you go back, you can find the original reason, original original reason of your enjoyment or desire to enjoy is shabda, either a sound, shabda sparsho or touch. You want to get touch, soft touch, shabda sparsho, roop. You want to enjoy beautiful, sub nature, beautiful hands, sub sub kichu. So shabda sparsho roop. It's called roop. That's why yesterday I told na, Papa speaking, everybody is busy with shape and design. The, that, that Jivatma, that Jivatma taking birth this life as a very beautiful lady. Very. I told na, in Nepal, there was one beautiful lady. Beautiful lady, there can be so many. But her beauty was so special that there was a big fighting with that lady. Who can marry? If somebody is going to marry, other can kill him. Her name was Amropali. Amropali. Her name was Amropali. Even big, 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 big king from different country, they used to change their clothes and come in secret way to meet with that girl. Father, mother has no girl. What can they can do? Finally, government, I mean, king took decision to declare that girl as national pros. That was the solution. Government was bound to declare that girl as national pros. Everybody can come, if they like. So, Buddha Dev also, you heard the name of Buddha. I am not speaking about Bhagavan Buddha. I am not speaking about our Bhagavan Buddha. It's that Buddha. Nepal, you see. He took birth. Our Buddha is Bhagavan. It's not Bhagavan. Buddha also was, you know, she also meet with Buddha. But Buddha not doing any rubbish thing. Only meet to bless her. So, if I speak you, that Amrapali, who is going to take birth as a beautiful lady, so that whole world fighting with the lady, and if I speak you, just next birth, Amrapali is going to take birth as a tribal girl. Very black, very dirty. Same, Amrapali. Try to understand, get my point where I say, that same Amrapali. Next life going to take birth in a tribal family, very poor, very ugly, black. You can fight with that girl. You can fight with that girl. Nobody fight it. There is a magic spell of Maya. Like you know, magician? Magician is straight. Chew. You say the girl is already uh, cut into pieces. Two pieces. One piece there, one piece. The girl is not. Uh, nobody going to cut that girl. But you all say that magician is going to cut that girl is you know, separated into two pieces. Not true. There was one world class magician. There was one world-class magician in our India. Nobody can beat in whole India. Nobody never can beat. His name is P.C. Sarkar. P.C. Sarkar. In open place. Anytime in open place. He used to, in open place, 
Those magicians, they are doing magic, magic in one stage. They are making magic in stage. But that magician used to make magic in open space, open in anywhere. One day, he was making magic in open space. Bombay Mill, Bombay Mill just uh, you know, stationed there. There was a big field. All you know, passengers, they come out because there is some, uh, some line problem. Uh, so train can delay. It is some um, one or two or three or four or who knows. I also suffer. I wanted to go to Puri, but in the meantime, in uh, you know, uh, some Chagda, train is detained. My train is there, and is that idiot is also many times miss train. That idiot, many times. Super fast train, very A class, A C, two tier, miss train. That idiot, always. Maharaj, I miss train. I miss train. Go, go to hell. I am going. My train also going. He is not coming. <laughs> this is idiot. This way. and going to. West that money, going to buy ticket, double pay, payment, Rajdhani, and going to meet me in Kanpur. And uh, is Kanpur, my train is there. He is coming, Maharaj, I come. How you come? <laughs> he come. Meet me in Kan Kanpur. Kanpur, I mean, uh, after 1200 kilometers, he is going to, 1200, more than 1200, he is going to meet me there in the morning time. How you come? But I waste my money, I again take, I come. This is the thing. So Bombay Mail detained it. Every all passenger like to see magic there. Everybody enjoying. RPC Sarkar going to show magic. After that, PC Sarkar is going to show different kind of magic. And they're going to get the train. When they look at the look at the rail, train is not there. Bombay Mail not there. They say, Are, where our train gone? No whistle, nothing. Where our train gone? They are busy watching, because long distance. They thought we can catch train, whistle must be there. We can run. But when they look back, our train gone. Where gone? Magic, magic. Train vanish. This kind of magic they used to show. PC Sarkar. So if PC Sarkar can show, then about Bhagavan and his Maya, what kind of magic you can think? One magic show was there, PC Sarkar coming almost one hour after. All agitation, important people, for, you know, they are important foreign people, he used to go to foreign. They become very angry, why you are late one hour? Eh? We have some appointment, this, that. PC said, where is late? Where is late? But you see, is one hour late. You see your clothes. Watch, they are saying, hey, no let. They watch their watch, no let. They so long years shouting one hour let. But when you say, you watch your, you, you see your watch, where is let? They say, no let, nothing. This kind of magic. My point is that, my point is that, my point is that if one material magician who is not doing bhajan, if one material magician he has this kind of power, so what kind of power you can get? What kind of power you can get inside you if you are doing bhajan? PC Sarkar cannot show magic. Our Bhagavan Das Babaji Maharaj is this body gone to Vrindavan. Our Bhagavan Das Babaji Maharaj Kalna, his whole body gone to Vrindavan. Where is his body is here? So, what PC Sarkar can make any competition with uh, our Bhagavan Das Babaji Maharaj? Bhagavan Das Babaji Maharaj is Kalna. But his body already gone to Vrindavan. He is going to take care of the uh, Tulsi orchard, you know. One stick and chagal, you know, goat going to. So, what kind of magic is there? Those Vaishnavas, they can get so much power, they can do anything. In life of my Guru Mahaja, I see. Cancer, blood cancer going to die. No father can save in the life of Guru Mahārāj. She is also living now. Guru Mahārāj never wanted to sow. Never wanted to sow this thing. So, I can, uh, this kind of Abhirbhāp coming, Tirubhāp coming, we can discuss. So, they can do, but they don't like to. Pohupāt, 
Prabhupada, all 18 different kind of, all 18 different kind of, you know, all Yoga Siddhi, all 18 different kind of, Ashta Siddhi 8, and after that 10, 18 Yoga Siddhi was completely resting with Prabhupada. Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati. But he never, he never tried to apply anything. It's offensive. It is not good. Offensive means you cannot get bhakti. Prabhupada never wanted to. One day when Prabhupada was small, somebody asking, can you speak me the date of, can you speak me the exact date, date when I am going to die? One man asking to Prabhupada, small boy, very expert in astrology. Still today, the papers of Saraswati Jakur, Bhakti Shri, outside world. One uh, Panjika, you know, Panjika, eh? P.N. Bhakti. P.N. Bhakti is the important Panjika in the whole India. He was a student of Prabhupada. When Prabhupada used to give uh, you know, teachings of astrology, astronom eh? astronomy. Now that man asking, <coughs> can you speak the exact date when I am going to die? Then Popat going to calculate, small boy. Calculate and speak, this year, <coughs> this year, this month, this year, this month, this week, this, you know, day, I mean, Monday or Sunday, particular day, and this time, and this second, this hour, this second, you are going to die. When Bhakti Vinoto came to know that Bhimala Prasad, the small boy, is going to give the exact date of when Bhakti Vinoto is going to chide the small boy. Why you speak? Why you speak? Why you speak the date of exact time when he is going to? Well, he asking me. Never try to do any more. Never try to do. Don't give. It's kind of because. He can lose all your energy. Try to understand what I say. Bhakti Mata wanted to say, he has some karma fall. Try to realize. He has some karma fall. He has to suffer. Don't understand. He has some karma fall. Nah? You have to suffer. But when I know death is there, he cannot do anything. Oh, I am going to die. Then karma fall, how he can, how he, how he can cut karma fall? Bhakti Mata said, never from today onward, never try to do. From that, from that, that day onward, but Prabhupada never, Bhimalabhasa, never speak anything. Anything asking, I don't know. Not speaking. So, how much power was there? Eighteen different kind of Siddhi was completely there with Prabhupada. Completely there. But still, Prabhupada never wanted to take undue advantage of. But we like to look astrology, astronomy, prasana, open, watching, the, what is happening. We cannot depend upon Bhagavan, 100%. That is the main problem. I can discuss this point evening time. So, I like to speak. Popat from Jokpi, Popat from, Popat from Chaitanya Mart. One day night time. One day night time from Chaitanya Mart. Popat doing bhajan in his bhajan kutir. One day, Popat doing different kind of lila. Nobody knows when he can... Suddenly, Popat coming on from the room and running towards Jokpit. Night time, 12 o'clock over, 1 o'clock. Why Popat running? No. One devotee was doing Harina. He could say, Popat running. He also running behind. He going to, Jokpit was open. Now, not like that. Because that time it was just, just Jokpit Mandir. No arrangement. Popat going to Jokpit Mandir and that, you know, that man, I mean, devotee also running. Finally watching, Papa is going to reach Jagapitsa Mandir. All Gandharva, Kinnar, demigods, they are going to worship Prabhupada. Coursing up here. He is from distance watching. From long distance, what is there? There are light and light all around. Illuminated all around. What is this? He just turned like he is going, watching on ghost. All gods in Dhimmi gods, Gandharva, Kinnar, they are worshipping Prabhupada. Let's stop. He gone mad. This is Prabhupada. This is Prabhupada. How we can take the post of Prabhupada? 
Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Maharaj. Even Bhagavan cannot take the post of Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Even Bhagavan. If Krishna likes to take the post of Prabhupada Bhakti, he cannot take. So high class. So this way, all our different kind of demand, all our different kind of annavilas going to put us in trouble. Many times Prabhupada used to say, who can put us in trouble? Actually, we are going to put us in trouble. Prabhupada many times told, who is going to put you in trouble? Many people like to kill me. Many people told in written form, get ready. Bharti Maharaj, no. I saw the paper and magazine. They like to write, get ready to die. Go to Jamalaya. I said, okay. Finally, when they are taking preparation, then I thought, uh, really I am going to die or not? I was not fear. I am not feeling fear. I thought, really I am going to die or not? So if I can know that I am going to die tomorrow, I can concentrate way more, you know, uh, for unto a lotus feet, more concentrate I can, like Khattanga Raja. But finally somebody told, no, nobody can kill you. Somebody told, big, big man, he is in, in, uh, yeah, in Baranasi, Vish, Kashi Vishwanath. He is the topmost man who can see. He said, no, nobody can kill you. They can try, but cannot kill you. I said, okay, then I can try my seva. Hello. Some man took me forcefully. And I, Vishwanath, I many times before also went there. At present, situation is very complicated. Anyway, so, this way, Prabhupada used to say, nobody can kill you. Who can kill you? If there is luck, I can speak with some, now time cannot find it. One astrologer, big astrologer told that your daughter is going to die today, uh, today. Today going to die. I can speak this incident. How miracle! She was just inside room, but inside room it died. Inside room, closed room, nobody can die. If it is written there, anyway. So, this way, elephant going to take the enjoyment of meeting with sea elephant. Elephant is running to meet with sea elephant to enjoy, and that is the great danger for that elephant. He is coming in trap, he is coming, coming in trap, and is going to, you know, this way problem. This way, when karma, when different kind of demand and karma coming inside our heart, then all our rationality, all our judgment go away. Like camphor, you know, camphor, camphor, you know, camphor. Are camphor, camphor, you are doing arati. That camphor, if you put there, all gone, vaporize. When karma is going to enter your heart, all your consciousness, all your rationality, all vanish. You can become blind. I can discuss this point evening time. Chaitanya Chaitanya is speaking. Chaitanya Chaitanya, what Krishna does? We are so lucky. We are so lucky, we are going to get Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami. We are going to get, you know, Rupa Goswami, you know, Sanatana Goswami, Jiva Goswami. No problem. You bring any problem, I can show you solution. They all solve everything. In whole world, any problem there can be solved in India. Not in India, here. In front of a sadhu. All solution. They can fight each other, no solution can come up. This way, I can show you what Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami is speaking. Krishna Das Kaviraj Goswami what is speaking. Very nice. So, just like, you know, ghost coming inside us. When ghost is going, going to enter, then you lose your consciousness and ghost, now ghost is going to drive you. You can become naked, you can dance, you can laugh, you can kill. This is the condition or bonded soul. So, elephant Elephant running towards she elephant is quite natural, can be there because they are driven by natural instinct. 
those beasts and birds, those beasts and birds, they are driven by, they are guided by their, you know, natural instinct. But what about you? Bhagavan give you brain, intellect, rationality, everything, why you are going to do it? So what is the difference between animal and man? Is there any difference? No difference? That's why Vaishishtha Muni told, na? That's why Vaishishtha Muni told, Ahar nidda bhaye maithonancha samanna metat pasubhi naranam gyano vishesha adhiko naranam gyane no hina pasubhi samana. I can explain now to have no time, I have to run anyway. So, uttishtata jagrata prapa varanu nivodhato kurasya dhara nishithaya durgam pathastat kabhayo vadan. Dangerous way. You are running towards fire. You are going to burn yourself. Be careful. Alert. Sadhu Guru Vesha always giving alert. You know? Like at the time of, you know, I told you, na? In small boy, I heard, they, oh, oh, siren. Man, now our enemy is going to uh, attack. All be careful. When some enemy is going to attack or any big storm coming, Everybody should be inside room. Oh, oh, siren. So Sadhu Guru Vaishnava by the Harikatha always give you alert. Be careful. Be careful. Be careful. The domesday coming. Domesday, you know? Domesday coming. Domesday means when you can go to Jamalai, that day coming. Be careful. Be careful. Vancha Kalpatar Vaishnava ke pas in the Bhavish. Patitanan Kavan. Vaishnava From tomorrow, I will have to run fast. Because anyway, maybe next year also. Because this vast chapter, this vast chapter, vast chapter, I, I, I cannot complete anything. Impossible. So depth. If you whole life, you will sit. Whole life. So long you are going to live on this earth and so long I'm. I can go on discussing about this, only this, you know. Huh? 